Welcome back to Military Update Channel. Russia deploys Avangard missile into combat duty. Facts on invincible weapon. Russian President Vladimir Putin described the Avangard as invincible and claims the weapon can hit any target on Earth in 30 minutes and at 27 times the speed of sound. Russia readies hypersonic missile for launch in fresh nuclear threat. It can be fired by various ICBMs, including the country's newest and most advanced intercontinental ballistic missile, the RS-28 Sarmat. Russian President Vladimir Putin stated that the weapon can travel toward targets like a meteorite, a fireball. According to the Russian military, placing a rocket into the launcher is a skill. A loader removes the missile from the vehicle, guiding it into a vertical position before slowly descending it into the launch shaft. Russia's Ministry of Defense has reported that a regiment with an intercontinental hypersonic avant-garde missile system has entered combat duty in the Orenburg region. The Russian Defense Ministry deployed its ferocious avant-garde hypersonic missile into combat duty at the Yastinskoy missile formation in the Orenburg region in southern Urals. According to Russian news agency TASS, it is one of six next-generation weapons announced by Russian President Vladimir Putin. The avant-garde warhead can travel at a hypersonic speed of about 32,000 kmph while maneuvering and overwhelming any missile defense. A CSIS report further claimed that this is a nuclear-capable missile with a range of over 6 kilometers, a weight of about 2 kilograms, and the ability to carry a nuclear or conventional payload. The nuclear warhead on the missile is more than 2 megatons in TNT equivalent, the TASS report claimed. <laughs> Avangard's maneuverability, according to CSIS, could make its trajectory unpredictable, complicating intercept attempts after its boost phase. There have been approximately 14 flight tests of the Avangard between 1990 and 2018, CSIS report said. Avangard hypersonic missile. The Avangard HGV is developed as part of the top secret project 4202 and given the codename U-71. In March 2018, Russian President Vladimir Putin first disclosed the missile during his annual State of the Union address. At the time, Putin said, I can tell you that we have all this already and it works well. Moreover, Russia's industry has begun to batch produce this system. It is yet another type of strategic weapon at Russia's disposal. We've called it Avangard, striking like a meteorite. Russia shows how it's impossible to intercept Avangard hypersonic missile gets loaded. The Avangard warhead can perform direction and altitude maneuvers, evading any anti-missile systems and flying through the dense layers of the atmosphere at hypersonic speeds of up to Mach 27. This HGV originated in the 1980s when the Soviet Union began developing warheads capable of traveling at speeds well above the speed of sound. However, the project was put to rest around the time of the Soviet Union's disintegration in 1991. NPO Australia, a Russian defense contractor, purportedly revived the development in the mid-1990s under the codename Project 4202. The Avangard underwent roughly 14 flight reported tests between 1990 and 2018. At the end of December 2018, the weapon was fired from the Domborovsky missile site in Orenburg, Russia. The HGV, which had traveled more than 6,000 kilometers, was launched from an SS-19 ICBM toward a target at the Kira shooting range in Kamchatka. Russia has constantly stated that it is working on hypersonic weapons to ensure that its strategic forces can surpass any future American air and missile defenses. The Avangard glides through the atmosphere, relying on re-entry to accelerate to its peak speed. It is reportedly capable of making dynamic flying maneuvers to evade detection. The Avangard is 5.4 meters long and weighs roughly 2 tons. The nuclear warhead of the HGV has a TNT equivalent of more than 2 megatons, according to TASS sources. The Avangard HGV can be installed on the RS-28 Sarmat, Russia's most powerful intercontinental ballistic missile. The RS-28 Sarmat can carry approximately 10 tons of payload, equating to about 5 Avangard HGVs. 